All right, this whole SQL thing seems to be tripping people up. That's a database, right? SQL, that's a language. Right, the language is SQL. It stands for Structured Query Language. It is the de facto language for all relational databases, for all data warehouses, and for a lot of big data tools, all right? If you want to work in any data space, we've already talked about it, you're going to have to know it. The language is divided into two things, DML and DDL, all right? Data manipulation language, data definition language. This is how we manipulate the data. We manipulate the data. This is how we define objects. Create database here. Create table goes here. Insert, update, delete goes here. Lots of people have their own database. The top two in the world are SQL Server and Oracle. Oracle is also in charge of O-R-A-C-L-E. MySQL. MySQL is also very big. And then the rest are fringe. These are the big three. These are database vendors, right? This is Microsoft, Oracle, and Oracle again. You're not just going to be able to learn the language. You're going to have to learn a lot about the database, right? About the database, how to install it, how to install it, how to install the interface tool, install interface tool, how to back it up. Why? Because often organizations back up, back up the databases and restore them. And if they're small enough, they restore them to dev servers. So you might have to learn to restore a SQL server used to be common back in the day. It's not so much anymore, but these are all things you'll have to understand. You'll also have to understand the OS it's installed on. Now, you won't have to be an expert, but you'll have to understand the basics, right? So when I say you'll have to understand more than the language, it's all this. It's also the internals. Internals, right? doesn't matter what role you are. You're going to have to know a lot about the internals. Define a database. Define a table. This is a table. This is a column. How do we create columns? Well, we use data types. All of databases use data types to define what goes in the column. It could be an int for numbers. It could be var char for Textual data, right? You're going to have to know all that. This is how tables are related. You're going to have to understand that. What is a primary key to foreign key relationship? What is a one-to-many relationship? Right. What's an index? All those things you're going to have to understand. Internals. So when someone says, oh, I just want to use Postgres, you can use anything you want. I don't care. Use whatever you want to learn the language. If you don't want to use SQL Server, which is silly, it's one of the top databases used in the world, uh, you can learn it on your own, right? It doesn't matter what you use, but you have to learn all this other stuff too. So if you're going to learn Oracle, you've got to learn internals. Install it. All this you're going to need to learn, right? So I hope that clears it up. It's not just a language. It's far beyond the language. Like right? The language is relatively easy for what most of you are going to do, all right? It's this down here. It's all this. It's really not so easy. Well, it's easy. It's just you don't know about it, so you're not going to learn about it. And someone says in an interview, so what's a cluster and index? And how many can a table have? Your face is going to go blank, right? And then the answer is one, and you're going to have to know why a table can only have one clustered index. And you're going to have to know what an index is first. It's not just the language. It goes far beyond that for, for anyone working in data. You're going to have to know all this down here, right? The internals are the basics of the internals. All right, now don't forget about the new course. We've got Fabric, an end-to-end -end look at Fabric for Data Engineers, and that includes DP600 for the exam, the exam cram. And we can click here to navigate to take a look at the curriculum, see what we've got going on. It's quite involved. All right, come back here. We want to come over. Yep, you're sure you want to buy it. Yeah, you're sure.
you got lots of other courses down here too. You can come down here and click on the courses and click view more courses. You can see you've got just an insane amount of courses on machine learning and data cleansing and data engineering and lots of stuff going on. All right, back to LogicBot. Back to the bottom. Enroll now. Enroll today. Come back here and have a coupon. YouTube. 25 hit apply and it's 25 dollars every month after that it's 20 dollars time to level up your game folks every day you're not learning someone else is